Hey guys, for Collider News, I'm Natasha Martinez. Leica CEO and President Travis Knight just made his directorial debut with Kubo and the Two Strings. While promoting the film, he talked about what Leica has planned for the future, and it sounds like they're moving in a dramatically different direction. Leica has been on a steady pace delivering one film every two years, and every film they do features a young protagonist. But it looks like that won't be the case going forward. During a chat with Cartoon Brew, Knight says he sees Kubo as the end of a cycle. This film is a good buy in a number of different ways, the themes that it deals with, loss and grief, but it also deals with healing, compassion, forgiveness and empathy. And so it is effectively the end of the first cycle of films that we've done at the studio. Our next film does not feature a child protagonist. I don't even know that there are any children in it at all. I wouldn't say it's adult oriented, but it's a different kind of film for us. Knight also revealed hopes to up their output to one movie per year. The way we make films, there's only so many films you can do in that time that you have, and I want to tell so many different kinds of stories in so many genres, so we have to figure out a way to overlap these productions. Ultimately, the goal is to be on an annual cycle, releasing a film every year. Knight also addressed whether or not we'll see any Leica sequels. I take a firm stand against sequels. You put so much of yourselves into these movies. It does come at a cost. You give and give and give to these movies. If we're going to do that, it needs to matter. It has to mean something. I don't want to tell the same stories over and over again. For more on Kubo and the Two Strings and what lies ahead for Leica, head on over to Collider.com and be sure to subscribe to the Collider Videos YouTube channel to keep up with all the must-know movie news.